you know, owning your own restaurant. Things like this happen every single day. The fact that they all happened in one day was phenomenal. So I think it was a Saturday. It was not a full moon, but I think Mercury was in retrograde. As I'm waking up, my produce salesperson calls me. Our produce delivery driver was about to come to our place and uh, they got robbed at gunpoint. So that started the day. Then I walk into the restaurant and the cooks at the end of the night didn't mop the floor. Is an independent chef restaurateur, every minute counts. So having to take an extra 15, 20 minutes and sweep the floor, it just puts me back. And then I proceed to find two pans of delicious strawberry bread pudding that were left out all night to spoil. You know, expensive ice cream base and organic strawberries and it was all gross and nasty. So I had to toss, which hurts my heart, and of course my pocketbook. So we start lunch service at Juhu Beach Club. We have mint chutney and we have cilantro chutney, and they both look similar when they're in the squeezy bottle. Cooks, we do this thing where we like kind of squeeze a little towards your nose just to smell to make sure it's the right one. But when I went to squeeze it, it just shot straight up into my face and in my eyes. And there's a significant amount of garlic in that chutney. I had to shove my face in a bowl of ice water. And then my midday dishwasher is an hour late. If we had known that the dishwasher was gonna be late, we would have like managed that. But assuming that he's gonna be arriving, everyone just keeps like piling on dishes. We're having to like weed through things to find things that we need and like quickly wash them and run back out on the line. And then we go to take out the garbage in the middle of the day and the garbage room key is totally missing and the door is locked. We start dinner service. One of the customers starts complaining about the wings. They're different than described on the menu. Well, lo and behold, people have the wrong menus with cheaper prices. I have to jump off the line and go print more of the right menus. And of course my printer prints like one menu every like three minutes. So the guy's pissed as hell. He leaves no tip and writes us a shitty Yelp review, whatever. And, you know, somehow we, we get through the whole night and I'm like, oh my God, this day has been crazy. I just want to ride my bike home. And I look outside and it's pouring rain, which is just like the perfect ending. 